automatically? Okay. Welcome back to another Ghost FPV episode, guys. Remember to hit like and sub if you already aren't a sub. Today, we're trying out ultralight drones. Um, this is my Pickle Race 5 inch build. You've seen it when I was doing the uh, laps around the track there in the field. I use this drone for racing, but it's also an ultralight. It's a Le Drone Club Pickle Race 5 inch frame. It could fit all the 533 switchback DPU accessories. But that's a bonus. I got the 2204 SPC Maker um, Ultralight uh, motors on here. Uh, it runs a 6S right now. It's an analog, so obviously you see the analog window at the top right there. But yeah, this is mad fun. Mad fun. Hopefully you guys like it. I'm in Scarborough here, just kind of ripping it out, waiting for the double lettuce. So I decided to rip up the neighborhood, just standing there in my car. Having buildings is the bomb. Check this out. It's pretty simple, just free falling, but I get my practice. You know? I'd like to dive something taller at the ceiling tower, but that's more complicated. You need no jam for that. The motor sound pretty nice on this guy. Lots of uh, lift and hang time. If it's ultralight, it stays up there. Stay inverted for a second and a half longer, two seconds. Depends on your punch up. The fly is like a dream. I got no qualms with it. I find this one of the most fun drones in my. Uh, my uh, I find it's a fun drone to fly. There you go. Damn fun. And you know what? It's not that loud. It doesn't irritate. On a full punch out, you can hear it. But it's not like my bigger drones where you can hear it. Well, it's pretty much a wrap, guys. Hopefully, you enjoyed my little Ultra 250 freestyle. Maybe take your time and build one of these up. It's really fun. Yeah, also, I got a little get up there. I look like a Ukrainian soldier taking down Russian tanks there. Setup right here. Let me close this up. You see my new setup here. I got the ghost military gear, the new chest pack. I know Steel calls this the chesty. I call this the bestie. 